The Veterinary Technology Program is unique here at Weatherford College because of a very unique relationship we have with the City of Weatherford and the Weatherford Parker County Animal Shelter, where we work with them in their medical facility, teaching our classes in a clinical setting so that all of their learning is hands-on at the college with professional instructors guiding them each step of the way. I'm actually already in a clinic right now as a lead kennel tech and a room tech assistant. They've really helped me see what I want to do as far as possibly moving up into a management position. This program is really going to help me get there. It's vitally important that you get the amount of hands-on experience to be confident in what you're doing so that when you walk into that practice, you can immediately show them that you are at a level where they can begin to trust you very soon. The students are in a two-year program to get their Associate of Applied Science in Veterinary Technology. We have our initial AVMA accreditation, and so they will officially be able to sit for the Veterinary Technician National Exam at the end of their time here. We are the number one cutting horse capital of the world. What that means for our veterinary technicians is that they need to be prepared when they go out into the field to handle these animals. The equines in this area are used for working farms, ranches, they're not just pets. So basically I'm in this program to be an equine vet tech. I feel like I would get more hands-on experience being a vet tech than just a vet and getting to work with the horses a little more closely. My goals are to eventually specialize in physical therapy. Um, I'm going to go into more canine and feline physical therapy and hopefully work with prosthetics. This program is helping me get hands-on experience, learning how to handle, um, learning how to care for the animals especially. And then it's also shown me that there's so much more in the vet tech world that we don't know about. Currently, there is a great shortage of veterinarians in the state of Texas. I think it's true in many states. The technician can serve as a well-trained colleague um, to actually reduce the need perhaps for another associate veterinarian because of the range of tasks they can do and the level of supervision that they don't need to have that someone else would need to have. People can stay close and go far.